are already aware of the need of a standard unit to measure weight. Gram and kilogram are standard units used to measure weight. Let us learn about the standard units of weight with Rosie and Uncle Sam. Hello Uncle Sam. Hey Rosie. Are you going to the market? Yes. Would you like to join me? Yes. Come, let's buy some vegetables and I will also teach you about weight. Look at Raju, the vegetable seller. He is selling some fresh vegetables. Come, let's learn about weight with the help of these vegetables. Look at this. This is a simple balance. We use a simple balance to compare the weights of two objects. It is similar to a seesaw. Nowadays, I see many shops using electronic balance to measure the weight. Yes, dear. That is the latest technology. Did you know we measure the weight of an object, our own weight, in grams or kilograms. We buy vegetables and grocery in grams or kilograms. Look, these are called standard weights. They are approved by the government. Hmm, this is so interesting. Do you know that one kilogram is equal to 1000 grams? Half a kilogram is equal to 500 grams. Quarter of a kilogram is equal to 250 grams. If you remember this, it will help you a lot when you go shopping. Okay, uncle. I'll keep that in mind. Now, let's see how we measure the weight of an object. See, Raju has kept a pumpkin in one pan and a one kilogram weight in the other pan. Look, the pointer of the balance is aligned with the center and both the pans balance each other. It means the weight of the pumpkin is one kilogram. Now, this position of the beam balance tells us the weight of the object. Now, we have to buy some tomatoes. Raju, give us some tomatoes. Okay, sir. Rosie, now you tell me how much do these tomatoes weigh? Can I try by keeping weights, Uncle Raju? Okay, dear. Look, she is keeping different weights to find the proper weight of the tomatoes. First, she keeps a one kilogram weight. But the pointer is towards the tomatoes and even the pans are not balanced. The pan with the tomatoes is lower than the pan with the weights. So, she removes the one kilogram weight and instead puts a two kilogram weight. Look, Uncle Sam, the pointer is aligned at the center and the pans are balanced. It means these tomatoes weigh 2 kilograms. Correct. 
Isn't it fun weighing different objects with standard units? Yes, uncle. I enjoyed it thoroughly. I have an idea. Let's go to the supermarket tomorrow to learn how to add and subtract kilograms and grams. Yippee! I'm so excited. Bye. Meet you tomorrow.